Oh my gosh, you guys. Ah, oh, that is a true story of how I came out to my dad. It was a very short conversation. <laughs> We're Italian, very dramatic. Um, I, uh, I feel like people don't really know how to talk to gay people. And I say this because I did a show the other week and this guy came up afterwards. I think he was trying to compliment me, but he didn't realize he was actually insulting me. He walked right up and he was like, uh, hey buddy, yeah, just wanna let you know for a gay guy, you talk uh, kinda gay, kinda straight, yeah. Yeah, you're like half and half. <laughs> well, thank you. <laughs> half and half, I don't know what that means, you know? What does that even mean? Like, <laughs> what am I walking around with my friends like, hey girls, let's go shopping for some pussy. <laughs> if it's on sale. I'll do it. <laughs> I don't know. I keep standing like Peter Pan. I, keep, <laughs> I don't know why I keep doing that. Like, oh, he was really gay, Peter Pan. <laughs> Wasn't Peter Pan like the super gay character? Like, I want to be a boy forever! <laughs> Got it. <sighs> I don't know. I, uh, so, like, the thing is, like, are there any other gays here? Right. <laughs> right, <okay. laughs> Just me. Um, I'm a lesbian. No. <laughs> so, you know, I'm gay. Uh, but to add on to that, my older brother is also gay. So my dad is... <laughs> proud. And the thing is, like, I was a very flamboyant kid. Like, there was no question that I was gay. But it didn't occur to me that my older brother might have also been a very flamboyant kid until my mom sent me some family videos recently of when we were younger. And it's when the Chicago Bulls won a championship. And they're going around the entire house and my whole family screaming. They're like, Michael Jordan rules! Michael Jordan rules! Then they get to my nine-year-old brother and he's like, well, if anyone rules, it's Janet Jackson. <laughs> She does not play for the Bulls, you know? <laughs> like, my favorite thing to, oh, this is so embarrassing, like, my favorite thing to do when I was a kid, I would come home from preschool, I was like four years old, and we had a giant tree in my backyard, and I'd walk around the tree every day and sing to the birds like Sleeping Beauty did. <laughs> every day. <laughs> <laughs> My neighbors did not respond the same way. <laughs> but I can just imagine now, like, my mom looking through the back window, watching me sing to the birds, having a conversation with my dad, being like, Steve, I think this one's gayer than the other one. <laughs> What is happening in my uterus? <laughs> it's like, what is, like, my mom is making so many gay kids. <laughs> Can you just imagine her gynecologist appointment just like, all right, Sherry, let's have a look in here and everybody does that! <laughs> that can't be right. Ba -da -ba -ba. You know, just. <laughs> Vodka shooting out of my mom's vagina. <laughs> oh, you guys have been great. Thanks so much.